I know why I dance when I talk. I guess that's what I do. Good morning, happy Friday, happy Vlogmas. I feel like by the time this is up, it will be Vlogmas. So welcome to another vlog. So I have a bunch of errands to run. I'm getting ready for Christmas. I'm so excited. I'm gonna take you guys with me. But first I have an orthodontist appointment that I have to go to because literally this wire is sticking out in my mouth and it's like, like scraping against my tongue. Make sure you are subscribed to my channel if you are not already, and also thumbs up this video if you're liking the vlogs, just kind of wanna switch it up. I also have hauls, make sure you guys check those out as well. Starting early this year because I feel like everything's out of stock earlier than it usually is, so we'll talk about that later. But I'll just show this in my fall hauls. Plaid flannel, it's kind of like a sports bra, it's from Forever 21. I believe these biker shorts, I've had them for a while. I don't even wear them that much. I think they're from Pretty Little Thing. They're not the best quality. They're pretty thin. I'm not a huge fan of them, hence why I don't wear them that much. And some easy slides. So, my little errand look for today. I'm pretty sure it's not that cold out. Hi, yeah. so I am back for the oil bonus. Good news, I might get my braces off the next time I go. Although, I don't know if I'm ready yet. And like I said, I'm gonna start Christmas shopping because I just feel like stuff's out of stock earlier and earlier now. Although I mostly have everything I need for Christmas, I just need some stuff, some decor pieces, which I'm going to pick up today. So I'm giving myself two weekends, this weekend and next weekend, to kinda get ready. I, I know I had a whole bunch of errands to run, Listen, if we look over at the clock, if it's happy hour, we're gonna go eat. That literally hijacks all our plans. Yeah, it's happy hour, we're about to go eat, okay? I'm having some sake, I absolutely love sake. We're at Ame. Literally get the same thing every time, and it's so good. Exactly why I got stuff early. I haven't shown you guys yet, but I got these the last time I was here. They're literally already gone. So these are the drums. I got mine earlier this week. The gold one's already out of stock. They're $40 here online. We're selling them about $70. Exactly, you get my point. That's why I got it early because I feel like stuff's going out of stock earlier and earlier. Saturday, today I'm going to run some more errands and I get um, some more Christmas stuff. Things. I'm doing that this weekend and next weekend. And again, I'm doing it early because I feel like, yeah, stuff's just out of stock earlier and earlier. I feel like when you wait last minute, what you're looking for is not there, especially with like the Halloween stuff, but, like they never restocked it. And but the situation with the ports, like I just don't trust them to restock this stuff in time. So I don't need a lot of stuff, but I want to do it now. And I've been putting out my tree early and earlier. I think I said this already. So I like to put it up before Thanksgiving because I like the idea or feeling of coming home after Thanksgiving and your tree's there and it's already Christmas. Also, I usually go home to New York, so I don't get to enjoy my tree that much. Although I think I'm staying here this year but we'll see love decorating i love the holidays my mom always made it so special so yeah just so excited to decorate and pick stuff out all right so this is what i settled on wearing like five different grays but it's fine this is from like a sweatsuit or lounge set that i got from fashion nova it's actually my first time wearing it but it has matching sweats or joggers so i paired it with some micro shorts i think these are from pretty little thing but i ripped the tag out because it'd be like you know stabbing me i'm pretty sure that's where these are from they're okay they could be better quality they're a little on the thinner side but i like that they're a bit longer for instance than the ones i had on yesterday just paired it with some like little crocs just want to be comfy but it's pretty warm out i think it's like 80 degrees but as it cools off it gets a little breezy so at least i'll be in the middle you never know out here what the weather is <laughs> so yep and that's today's 
comfy look. My Silk A Little Weekend bouquet. My high chanchies. I got green ones and white roses. So cute. Let's go run these errands. Packages that will be open tomorrow. I got the package to return, so actually I'm glad I saw that because I would have walked out and not have grabbed it. About to go do all that. Get our Christmas shopping on, guys. I don't know why I dance when I talk. I guess that's what I do. So I first shop at the 99 cent store. Honestly, I like to work, work my way up from cheap to expensive. So we're starting here. I found great stuff at the 99 cent store before I actually was looking at um, I got a CBT magazine and a Neiman Marcus and a Z Gallery, their holiday issues. So I like to look at that and see if I can replicate it for cheaper first. If I can't, I'll go ahead and purchase it from those stores. But other than that, we start here, see what I can get for the low, and go from there. Some good stuff so far and some extra stuff. <laughs> Never hurts to start with a 99 cent store. And this is my first time and this one's pretty spacious. It's really big, so. I might be coming here more often. So we got some great stuff. 99 cent store definitely came through. I didn't get all Christmas stuff, but including what I, the Christmas stuff I got and the other stuff, I only spent $35. So breaking my way up. Our next stop is Walmart. I love getting stuff for a bargain. It is literally the most exciting thing. All right, I'm so upset my earring fell out. I'm really mad, but these are from H&M. I'll just try and get another pack because I really, really like them. Whatever, we are here at the Walmart. So, now I'm at Burlington. Uh, I always have some stuff here. And yeah, I'm trying to decide on my trees. But the decor is super cute. I'm trying to get some decor for my credenza. So. trying to see what goes with my color scheme but yeah I think I got some cute ones so I'm excited about that yeah so far I'm having a very great day I love it it's empty not too many people are shopping yet all these tree skirts are cute look at those I have a tree skirt but those are really, really cute okay yeah, not too many people are shopping yet, so the aisles aren't too cluttered. I feel like I can get what I want. It's like I have first dibs. Some stuff's already out. Like I saw these other trees, and there were two and not three. I need three. You get what I'm saying. So, so far, so good. I'm gonna go with those trees. So excited. I get so excited about this cute little side. <laughs> So we're back home. Pretty much spent the whole day out. Got a lot of great stuff. Huh? Our reservation's right. Okay, so yeah, got a lot of great stuff today. Literally went everywhere from like cheap to um, expensive, but we ended up at Home Goods last. I literally found something that I needed at every single location. But got home, took a shower, about to go grab something to eat because typically Friday night and Saturday night we don't cook. But other than that, we cook throughout the week. Like I'm gonna make, I think I'm gonna make chili tomorrow. But yeah. So I showed this look in my fall haul. So make, with these little boots. You know, just like a cute little date night. A fall look, like a date night fall look. Honestly, like I said, in my fall haul, it just hasn't been cold. So I feel like I haven't gotten to wear any of my fall looks and they're all going to waste because it's about to be the holidays and it's vlogmas. So we're about to just go grab something to eat, have a little date. We're about to try this from 75 out. We ordered two chips and guacamole. It's happening. Good morning. It is Friday. I'm about to head to the gym and try and get a workout in. But I'm so excited because it's finally well, it's vlogmas, but I will be decorating this weekend, so I will be showing you everything that I got. I'm actually going to go out and get some more stuff. I'm going to tie up some loose ends. been looking at some inspo, some stuff on IG and Pinterest and in my magazine, so I just want to incorporate some different stuff into my decor. And I want to show you guys everything all together. It'll just be easier that way instead of just picking up random stuff here and there. First, these good 
workout in and I'm so embarrassed to show you. I'm wearing the these are literally like one of my original pair of workout leggings, guys. Not cute at all. Pink logo and everything. But the reason I'm wearing these is because, yeah, I really work out. Like, I be squatting, I be lunging. Like, it is serious. I cleaned up yesterday, so my poop's sitting right there. Anyway, it's really important for me to wear comfortable leggings. I always find myself resorting back to the same like three or four leggings. I tried other leggings from pink, like who even wears pink anymore? Not that there's anything wrong, but you know what I mean. Like, it, I feel like it kind of ran its course. Um, but they're not even as comfortable as these. Like these are so stretchy. They're kind of like thermal too. They're really warm. Moral of the story is I'm always just looking for comfortable leggings and workout clothes. I'm really sensitive. I don't like my material too thin. I kind of like it thick. Uh, yeah, I'm just really sensitive to any little thing. It can't be too itchy. You guys, so I broke down and got a pair of Lululemon leggings. I broke down and I actually tried them on in the store about like two months ago and they were really comfortable. I was so upset when I put them on too. I was like, really? Okay. Honestly, I'm just getting it for the workout effects. Like I'm not getting it for the aesthetic or the just indulgence. I'm petite, but I'm kind of on the thicker side. So I just need stretchy leggings. Like I have thick thighs, I have a butt, but I've just been thinking about them ever since I tried them on. I literally was in the store, I was in the fitting room, did a whole squat in them. And it just felt really good and really comfortable. But see, I took my time. I thought about it. I didn't make an impossible decision. I'm not happy about it. I'm, I'm not. But whatever. So, about to head to the gym in my old ass, braggy ass, comfortable pink leggings, tiny. Yes, boo. About to get squats in. And I'm excited because I get to come back. It's finally decor weekend, Christmas decorating weekend. I love the holidays. I just love this time of the year. So right now I'm at Michael's. All the good stuff is pretty much gone. Yeah, I got here early. I did find these, like how pretty. I got to the store real early, don't you? Because all the good stuff is not here. Not happy about it, but it's cool. Gonna make it work. I was looking for more, and then everything that I like, there's only like one of it left. So, good morning. It is Saturday, and I have to go to a sound meditation, sound bath. About to send out, but. My new lemon leggings came, although we're not happy about this again. I'm going to get dressed and put those on because obviously, not that we're doing yoga, but you know, meditation, setting out, I need to remember to grab my yoga mat and having some tea. And the best part of the day comes when I come back because we're decorating the tree and I'm so excited. I got some really good stuff at Michael's yesterday. Where else did I go? I went to Joanne's because I was looking for a certain type of ribbon. I'm basically trying to recreate someone's tree that I saw. It was so cute. So I couldn't get everything that I needed. Y'all ran through Michael's, okay? Let's see, this is why you have to start earlier and earlier every year. Next year, I just know to be there early. I see how y'all get down. I see how y'all get down. So it's cool. I was supposed to start decorating yesterday, but I got home really late. Yeah. This is the package order. Lemon logo right here. Got the black leggings because I feel like anytime you're trying to brand out for me, I just have to start with black. I think it doesn't have it on here. I think it came up to like 104 or something. Again, not really happy about this, but you know, I got a size four. I knew I was a size four because I tried them on in person. It's so soft. It's so soft. They're like thin, but also thick at the same time, if that makes sense. It's just like a nice seamless material. So here we go. Just has your little lemon logo on the back, which I know some people wear this just for aesthetic reasons, just for the little logo. Honestly, I'm really wearing it for comfortability. Yes. Yes. 
He calls me and then says nothing. A line HR pant in 25 inches, size four. So that's everything. And I already need to basically get this length and this size because I tried them on in the store. And I have cheap leggings that fit just as good. It's, I feel like they don't make stuff the same quality like they used to. I'm just really picky with workout clothes I've purchased from a lot of different brands. I have a lot of sets, I have a lot of leggings. This is on with one of my little white tees from Target. It's my equivalent of a white tee, and little black dollar tees. I really like them. They're convenient just to throw on. They're super comfy. Like really, like I can squat. I'm happy to wipe this up. Comfy. Needs to go behind schedule. LA traffic. Yeah. Out here. <laughs> Everyone's still getting here, so got my mat all set up. So I'm back. I this is the easiest setup to like talk and show you guys stuff, so <laughs> that's why we're always in here. I feel cleansed. I feel ref I don't know. She either says something or does something that resonates. So my cards were judgment worry and surrendering really not judging others more so judging myself or worrying judging thinking something's not enough and she just was letting me know that you are enough surrendering like i was saying i feel like i need to be present be in the moment more i'm always in go 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 mode work 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 mode so that's something i want to work on especially with 2022 coming i just want to be able to be more present, have more fun, not be so type A, because I'm so type A, I'm as type A as it gets. Oh yeah, my leggings are so comfortable, you guys, I'm about to have a Lululemon problem. This is not the type of problem you want to have, like, at all, but so comfy. I have all my stuff down here, so I'm about to show you all this Christmas stuff, finally. Because <laughs> they're best for the Christmas show, so, so, so excited. That's what we're going for, feminine inner child divinity. And it's about being more childlike and more playful. And yeah, I just want to stop worrying, stop being judgmental, stop being up in my head and just surrendering into being and being in the now and being present. Got a little sweatshirt, super cute. And I'll put her link below because she also has like Zoom sessions, one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, we have started. everything out and I also brought a whole bunch of more stuff. Yeah, that's what she had first. Let me show you guys. Everything I've been buying these past couple weeks. First, I like to get inspiration. I'll be on Pinterest, I'll be on IG, just kind of looking at decor pages and stuff like that to see what I want to do. And then I get my magazine. So I think this one's this year. So Sea Gallery, just a little holiday magazine. Um, see? So I'll just kind of look and see what I want to do, what I want to incorporate, and stuff like that. I also got. Me too, and yeah, just see what one it, what Christmas stuff that I want to do. Like that's their credenza. Just kind of get some inspiration. So I like creating what I see first at a lower price point. That way, I'm not spending so much money. Or I like recreating what I see at a lower price point first, and I mean lower, because that stuff's expensive. But if there's something I absolutely want and I can't find it anywhere else, then I'll go ahead and purchase it from one of those stores. I'll just break down and do that. I also was at Crate and Bear looking around. So first I went to the 99 cent store. So first I got these balls because like, I wanna lay the balls out on my credenza and on this little tray, which I brought too. And I'll show you guys. This is my color scheme, like gold, silver, champagne mostly. So this is really my color scheme. So I'm obsessed with champagne, neutrals. So we got a gold set and these are each 99 cents. We got champagne and then we got silver. Next, I just got these flowers, which I'm gonna take apart and put on the tree. What is it, placentas, right? Puente Whatever. I got a whole bunch of these. 
We'll see how they look. They had other ones that were way underneath and I didn't like those. So I just got a whole bunch to literally put all over the tree. So I'm just gonna take them off the stems and stick them in the tree. Of course, bested ears just cause we like playing games and being festive. So I got reindeer, or they're both reindeer. And then this one's for my fiance. <laughs> Just when we like start wearing our pajamas. And I got more balls, so different size balls. Balls, balls, balls. <laughs> so just, I like different size balls. I feel like that's what makes the tree look really pretty when they're all different sizes. So that's something that I've noticed or learned over the years when decorating. Just having different size balls looks so pretty. And then we got more hooks. I feel like every freaking year you can never find your hooks and when you're damn near done decorating the tree, you find your hooks. So just be safe, we just got more hearts. Let's move over to the Target. This is actually the very first thing I got. I got this early. So I got my tree collar because last year, honey, and I think I showed you guys when I was in the store, they were gone. I did not, I saw them online and never saw them in person. So you guys must have got to them early because yeah. So tree collar, this from Target. It was only almost $40, so that's not too bad online. They're selling them for like 70 and $80. I think the one at Cream Barrel was like 100. It's literally the same exact thing. Absolutely not. I got some berries to stick in the tree. Although I wanted some silver ones too. I don't know if they had silver ones. I just saw gold. And then we got some lights. We'll probably put the lights up. Maybe we should put those up first. Got some ice lights to put up outside. Garland to, we have like a little hallway type area. So I want to put it, that's why I really wanted it. It was only $20, so that's not bad. But depending on how thin it is, we'll see. I might return it because I hate thin garland. Like it's not cute. Looks cheap. I did get more stuff in the 99 cent store too. I feel like I'm missing a bag. We're actually heading back to the 99 cent store. Some big snow. Then I wanna lay it down on my credence. I'm just trying to create like a little winter wonderland on top of there. We'll see how it goes. In my mind, yeah, we'll see how it goes. So these are 199. Oh hell no, I don't do 99 cents. Whatever. I got some reindeer and I I like my reindeer to be different heights. So these were the last two as well. I like the fact that this one's standing and this one's laying down. And then I found this one recently, actually like I think yesterday or the day before at Target. It was five dollars. And then I feel like they can be a family. <laughs> I'm so serious. Now they look like a family. Yeah. I feel like they're a little. Oh, this one. Eyes and the other ones don't have eyes. I don't know if I'm feeling the eyes. They look kind of scary. I might take the eyes off because these don't have eyes. But yeah, I feel like they can be like a little duo, a little family. Like, yeah. I love that for my reindeer that they're not alone. They're like a unit. Okay. I wanted standing reindeer to go by the tree. I was like, do not go overboard. Every year I get more and more stuff. So. I'll get those next year. Got, yeah, got more balls. We're still at the 99 cent store. So these were the bigger champagne balls. So yeah, I got small, gold, silver, and champagne. And then I got medium, gold, silver, and champagne. Let me show you guys those. Yeah, that way this is the medium set. Gold, silver, and champagne. Yeah, that's right, because these are champagne. See, that's my color scheme. I got pine cones in the 99 cent store. Because everywhere else, pine cones are kind of expensive. But obviously, only 99 cents. And my mom always puts pine cones on her tree. I actually decorate my mom's tree, but she has pine cones. And when I put them on, I really like how they look. So I always mean to get pine cones for my own tree. So I don't know if I'm gonna keep these or not because I also have some other ones. So we'll just see how everything looks. Um, I got these from Walmart. So Walmart was next on the list. And I mainly went to Walmart to look for lights and my reindeer, but I didn't see the ones I wanted. So I got a whole bunch of these put on the tree. So I guess they're doing the clips this year. This is the first year that I'm seeing clips instead of, you know, just sticking them in. I like sticking them in better because I feel like I can just pull it right out 
and stick it in somewhere else if I don't like the spot that I put it in. I feel like the clips are kind of like more labor, but they probably stay on better, but I don't, I didn't see a problem with the sticks, but yeah, it's like all about the clips this year on all this type of stuff at the Walmart. And I got snowflakes, although I have snowflakes, so I don't know why I got more. So we're going to Burlington next. So I got these three trees from my credenza and I love these because, and there's one more, so the tall one's gonna be in the middle. I love these because yeah, they're gold and silver, so they're basically like champagne. I love how festive and pretty these are and they also have tiny little pearls on them. Oh, just like my whole little vibe. Okay, the smaller ones or medium ones were $5.99. This is only $14.99, so that's not bad. All right, so next, <laughs> we're headed to Home Goods. Had this idea of just putting balls, like different color balls on this thing. I thought it would be pretty, so I'm gonna try it out. And it wasn't that much anyway. This was, uh, I got it for $15 because it was, it's kind of damaged. There's, I don't know if you can see exactly, if you see those little spots, so when something's damaged, yeah, this must be like, um, exactly. So she gave me like, I think $4 or something. So it's only $15, so it's not too bad. And then those balls you saw from the 99 cent store, I'm just gonna arrange them around here and try and create like a little centerpiece or something. Like, I don't know who I think I am. Who do I think I am, okay? Got these wine stoppers because I love wine and I feel like these were kind of festive. You can never have enough wine stoppers. Okay, so let's head back to the Target. <laughs> so I got some icing. I actually got my icing super early for Halloween because every freaking year when I'm ready to make my, either my brownies or my cupcakes, icing is freaking gone. So I got that shit early and then I saw this, although we typically only make cookies, for Christmas I was like you know what just pick that shit up just in case because I'm sick of stuff being sold out when I go there like I'm over it I'm over it and then every year we get the holiday blend coffee from Starbucks yeah just getting really festive in the mood I also noticed they had other flavors like graham cracker they had caramel so I'm tempted to try some other I have pajamas because I love like the felt thermal, whatever this is. So I got this print and I got them all in a size small. I hope they fit. So these are the women's pants. I don't know how much these were. Oh, they're only $10. That's not too bad. And honestly, I'm one of those people who still wear my Christmas PJs after Christmas. So I'm for sure wearing them till about Valentine's Day. They're warm, it is what it is, which is why I made my skin salt, because it's like, when I tell you, it's not that I look raggedy in the house, you know. So if it's warm and comfortable, I don't care what color it is, I'm about to throw it on. But I'm working on that, I'm getting better. It fell out, so I got this print. It's so cute. So I got these two. So I got these socks. I'm getting really into house socks. So I'll probably wear these now. Put these on. Just got some festive, oh, this is a two pack, nice to wear some holiday socks. Love those. Or last year, we started doing matching Tuesday. I got a small in men's. They're supposed to have women's, but the only women's one I saw was a gown. And I didn't want a gown. I like PJs, I like pants and a shirt. I got the men's small, and I think I took one out and tried to tie on in the store, and it, it seemed a bit fun. So we're gonna rock with that and see how it works. If not, receipts are in the back, okay? And then this one's for my fiance. Got a 2X just so he can, he, we both like our pajamas kind of big and roomy anyway. His and hers, they match, right? Are these the same? Why do they look, why does this one look more red on camera? They look different. Hold up, let me go figure it out. So yeah, they are not the same. Honestly, they're not that different. They're pretty similar. I'm so upset. I mean, I like these, but these ones look more festive and Christmassy. It seems like this print is smaller than this. Glad I'm doing this because I would have never noticed that. And I probably would have waited when we wore them and then realized they weren't the same. You know? Tarjay, what are you doing? Like, have stuff spread out in a separate corner. And why would you have two that are so similar anyway? I mean, they look the same, but they're not. Ooh, I'm upset. Okay. 
Next, I ended up at Michael's yesterday. The first thing I got, there was so much stuff that I wanted, but there was just one of it. And it's like, what am I gonna do with one thing? So I know to go to Michael's early next year, but then again, like I said, this stuff is kind of expensive, so I don't know about all that. I might be there at the same time next year when it's 40% off. So I got like four of these. So that's why I said, I don't know if I'm gonna use all of them because obviously these are the cutest ones. First, I wish I saw these first. I brought a whole bunch of them. So they were $7.99 each. And there were only four left. But luckily I got them at 40% off. Ooh, how pretty. See, how gorgeous. How freaking gorgeous. This is what I mean by creating stuff at a lower price point. Next I saw this and one branch was left but it was so pretty. So I'm thinking, although I don't know how I'm gonna do this cause this seems pretty thick to just be one branch in the tree. Like your tree has to be pretty big if you're putting this whole branch in. I figure I just kind of cut the branches, a little DIY. But like how gorgeous and everything's that nice champagne color which i love then i saw these some more branches i had like six of these these were 5.99 each so but i got them at 40 percent off and then i went to joann's because i was looking for a certain type of mesh ribbon so it's wire so at least it's bendable everything else wasn't wire that i saw that was cut out I also got some balls. So I was looking for a pack of white balls. I saw some at Michael's, but they were glass. And I, and I almost purchased them and I realized they were glass. I was like, no, I really should step on them glass balls. Okay, so anyway, I was like, nobody's messing with them glass balls. So I saw these at Joann's and this pack was $30. So at first I was like, um, no, it's not that serious. But then I realized everything was 50% off already. So this only came out to 15, so not too bad. And I need more white balls. I also need more silver balls. So this actually worked out perfect because it had both in one. I thought I was done, but now, as you guys remember, if I inserted that footage, I did go to Bath and Body Works and we got our Christmas candles. Let me start with my very favorite Christmas candle in the whole wide world. Frosted cranberry. I absolutely love frosted cranberry so much that I got two of them. It's my favorite Christmas candle. Absolutely love it. And I burnt it all last winter. This one smelled really good. It's called Bright Christmas Morning. Candles you see like $22.50, $23.50, $24.50. This year they are $25.50. Like y'all need to stop playing games. If they go up over that between y'all and gas, I'm good. I'm good. I'll be in the house not burning a damn candle. I'll be good. It smells like bright Christmas morning. I don't know how to explain it. It does smell like bright Christmas morning. Even though it's not Christmassy looking, it does have a snowflake. It's called Sugar Pomegranate. It's one of their newer scents this year. And I got this from my filming beauty room if we ever get that done. If we ever get that done, which is why we're in here. Because that room is a hot mess. But that's my project for Vlogmas in December, so I pray to God. We finished my filming room. Anyways, it just smells really good. Obviously, it smells like pomegranate, sugared pomegranate. Okay, so that was everything I got so far, because I will be getting more stuff for my winter home decor haul, I guess you can say. But we are about to go decorate the tree, and let's get the decorating. <laughs> on our balcony so excited she is literally perfectly blocked ah, she is slaying we got some reinforcements while we decorate around this time of year i'm really lax on my diet
attempted to work on my credenza, but it's pretty late. It's like almost 2 a.m. This is what we're working with. She's pretty. She's so cute. So I'm just trying to think if it needs anything else. I feel like I may need some more picks. But I basically got everything that was left at the store, so I may have to check another Michaels. So I don't know. I feel like she may need a little bit more silver. But other than that, she is giving honey. She is curves. She's looking like a queen. My fiance said she got a BBL. That was his little joke. And she does have some updates. I mean, everything's pretty much the same. We just added some more balls and all that stuff I showed you that I purchased. So I feel like she might need more picks, especially on like that side, on this side. I always try to decorate the front. So I feel like that's where we take pictures from and stuff like that. But anyways, I'm so tired right now. So it's almost 2 a.m. She's looking cute. I really wanted to add some reindeer, <laughs> but we'll see. So this is the original look. Might add some more pieces, but for now, she's cute. Well, hello. I just got back from Whole Foods. Decor is going up. I still have more decorating to do, but I need to make something to eat. I'm gonna make shrimp linguine. It's basically spaghetti, but I'm using linguine and I'm using shrimp and like onions and peppers. So my mom used to make it all the time and I honestly didn't know what to make today. And my mom was like, once you make that, that's simple and easy. 